let's say that Armand today is 18 years old. 18 years old. And let's say that Dia, Dia today is two, two years old. And what I am curious about in this video is how many years will it take? And let me write this down. How many years will it take? Will it take for Armand, for Armand to be three times times as old as Dia? As Dia. So that's the question right there. And I encourage you to try to take a shot at this yourself. So let's think about this a little bit. We're asking how many years will it take? That's what we don't know. That's what we're curious about. How many years will it take for Armand to be three times as old as Dia? So let's set, let's set some variable. Let's say y for years. Let's say y is equal to years, years it will take. So given that, can we now set up an equation, given this information, to figure out how many years it will take for Armand to be three times as old as Dia? Well, let's think about how, how old Armand will be in y years. How old will he be? Well, in y years, let me write it here. In, in y years, Armand, Armand, Armand is going to be how old? Armand is going to be, well, he's 18 right now. And in y years, he's going to be y years older. So in, in y years, Armand is going to be 18 plus y. And what about Dia? How old will she be? How old will she be in y years? Well, she's two now, and in y years, she'll just be two plus y. So what we're curious about, now that we know this, is how many years it will, will it take for this quantity, for this expression, to be three times this quantity? So we're really curious. We want to solve for y such that 18 plus y is going to be equal to three times, is going to be equal to three times two plus y. Three times two plus y. Notice, this is Armand in y years, this is Dia in y years, and we, we're saying that what Armand's going to be in y years is three times what Dia is going to be in y years. So we've set up our equation, now we can just solve it. So let's take this step by step. So on the left hand side, and maybe I'll do this in a new color just so I don't have to keep switching. So on the left hand side, I still have 18 plus y, and on the right hand side, I can distribute this three. So three times two is six, 3 times y is 3y, 6 plus 3y. And then it's always nice to get all of our constants on one side of the equation, all of our variables on the other side of the equation. So let's, we have a 3y over here. We have more y's on the right-hand side than the left-hand side. So let's get rid of the y's on the left-hand side. You could do it either way, but you'd end up with negative numbers. So let's subtract a y from each side. And we are left with, we are left with on the left-hand side, 18, and on the right-hand side, you have 6 plus 3 y's. You take away one of those y's, you're going to be left with 2 y's. Now we can get rid of the constant term here. So we will subtract 6 from both sides. Subtract 6 from both sides. 18 minus 6 is 12. The whole reason why we subtracted 6 from the right was to get rid of this. 6 minus 6 is 0. So you have 12 is equal to 2y. 2 times the number of years it will take is 12. And you could probably solve this in your head. But if we just want a 1 coefficient here, we would divide by 2 on the right. Whatever we do to one side of equation, we have to do it on the other side. Otherwise, the equation will not still be an equation. So we are left with, we are left with y is equal to 6, or y is equal to 6. So going back to the question, how many years will it take for Armand to be three times as old as Dia? Well, it's going to take six years. Now, I want you to verify this. Think about it. Is this actually true? Well, in six years, how old is Armand going to be? He's going to be 18 plus 6. We now know that this thing is 6. So in in six years, in six years, Armand is going to be 18 plus 6, which is 24 years old. How old is Dia going to be? 
Well, she's going to be 2 plus 6, which is 2 plus 6, which is 8 years old. And lo and behold, 24 is indeed 3 times as old as 8. In, in six years, Armand's 24, Dia's 8, Armand is 3 times as old as Dia. And we are done.